Two of the top console creators have announced their gaming systems. Learn more about here at Hot News. Hi, my name is Guillen, producer from Only Hot Tech, bringing you some hot gaming news every Saturday. Today we'll be talking about the amazing PS4 that was presented at E3 last June 10, 2013. It made the fans go nuts on the YouTube live stream and of course, the people who are at the event. I've seen how the system improved even though I don't have one from the past three generations, from the design, hardware, software, controller, and some features formulated from how people want to use it and how people want it to be. Before the real PS4 design was released, a lot of pictures or leaked pictures of PS4 designs was floating around Google that made me think of what the PS4 design really is. The PS4 tower design resembles the PS2 that also includes a base that helps a console to stand, but it also can be on horizontal orientation. In front of the console, we can see an alternate glossy and matte finish, and the DVD-ROM is located near the two USB 3.0 ports at the side. You can see the PlayStation logo and a straight blue LED lighting. At the back, you can see different ports like the auxiliary, Ethernet, HDMI, and optical ports. Moving on to the controller, the design of the DualShock 4, the button orientation is still the same. They've added the share button and the option button that you can use for Twitch or any other streaming sites. The option button lets you go to the menu which is very helpful. The touchpad is clickable but I haven't seen a gameplay where it is used. The blue LED was for motion tracking and all of these for only $60 a piece. The console will retail for $399 US dollars, $399 Canadian, $399 Euros, $349 Pounds, an Octagore X8664 AMD Jaguar processor, a 1.84 teraflops next generation Ragen graphics card, an 8 gig GDDR5 memory, a 500 gig hard disk drive which is removable and upgradable. The dimensions of this device would be 275 by 53 by 305 millimeters. The mass 2.8 kilograms, Blu-ray or DVD drive, two USB 3.0 ports, Ethernet port. Bluetooth capabilities, HDMI, and optical port. The package includes the system itself, DualShock 4 controller, one piece, mono headset, one piece, an AC power cord, HDMI cable, and USB cable. Moving on to the features of the new PS4, we have the region free feature, which can be played anywhere you want, in the bathroom, in the jungle, in the garage or in the road if you want or in your car so it's region free you can play anywhere you want that has a tv and power offline and online compatibility in single player you can play offline anywhere you want anytime any time of the day even your mom is sleeping or your dad is sleeping you can play multiplayer on online but you need to pay fees for that monthly or for a year. You can sell your old games or you can trade them, lend it to other people, give it to other people or you can give it to me. That would be good. So I won't be bothering to buy any PS4 game out there in the market. Just send me some. I'll be free. I'll put the links and my addresses down below if you want just joking there are also other features that was featured on e3 this is the playstation plus where you should pay 50 dollars if you want to play on multiplayer servers but you can enjoy the 17 free video games yeah so thank you for watching guys 
Don't forget to like, comment if you have any suggestions on how will I improve this hot news, you know? And subscribe to the Avoc TV channel. Shout out to Sir Matt, the CEO of Avoc TV, for giving me this kind of break. I really love Avoc TV and how it works. So if you want to be a partner on Avoc TV, check the links down below. If you want to pre-order PS4, check the links also down below. If you want to subscribe to my channel to see more gaming reviews, product reviews, product unboxings, unboxings of my box, and other boxes of in the world. So, this is me, Ian, signing off. Peace, mother surprise, you know? Yeah! Behind the scenes on my channel.